all our young lives, we search for someone to love, someone who makes us complete. We choose partners and change partners. We dance to a song of heartbreak and hope, all the while wondering if somewhere, somehow, there's someone perfect who might be searching for us. I've known Jess since we were in seventh grade, but to be honest, I don't remember my life without her by my side. You've been such a good friend to me, and I can always count on you for the best advice and a really good laugh. When Jess first told me about a 40-year-old guy she had met in a bar, <laughs> a guy who loved air guitar, and was never married, and had no intentions of getting married, I may have told her to run. But one of the things that I've always admired and respected most about Jess is her fearlessness. So despite my advice to run from that guy in the bar, Jess took a risk. And when I met Mark, I totally understood why. His outgoing personality, his optimism, your love of learning, your love of family, and your quick sense of humor make you the perfect partner for Jess. Family and friends, we thank you for joining us today on this amazing occasion of the wedding of, of Jessica and Mark. They are so thrilled and happy to have all their loved ones and friends to celebrate on this amazing day. Mark and Jessica met a couple times. This wasn't, the, it wasn't like a one-time thing. What's amazing about the universe is how the two of them actually fell in love. Um, I was amazed at the complex series of events that really had to take place. Um, it was nearly a decade <laughs> of time for this to happen. A million things had to go right, and even more things could have gone wrong. But the universe really does work in magical and amazing ways, which orchestrates just the right circumstances and events to happen in perfect timing for the both of you to get together on this amazing day. Only some sort of a higher power and a patient one at that could have orchestrated this scenario. And if you ask Mark and Jess, though, they would tell you that on that St. Patrick's Day in 2013, it truly was love at first sight. Mark, do you promise to love Jessica for who she is now and for who she is yet to become? Do you promise to listen and learn from her, to support her and to accept her support? Will you celebrate her triumphs and mourn her losses as though they were your own? Will you love her and have faith in her love for you through all the years and all that life may bring to you? Mark, do you take Jessica to be your beloved wife, knowing in your heart that you will be a faithful friend and a loving companion? I do. Jessica, do you promise to love Mark for who he is now and for who he is yet to become? Do you promise to listen and learn from him, to support him and to accept his support? Will you celebrate his triumphs and mourn his losses as though they were your own? Will you love him 
and have faith in his love for you through all the years and all that life may bring? Jessica, do you take Mark to be your beloved husband, knowing in your heart that you will be a faithful friend and a loving companion? I do. So now, by the power granted to me by the state of New Jersey and in front of all your family and friends, I have the absolute honor and privilege to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. First of all, I want to thank everybody that's here tonight. Hope you're having a great time. There's people from California, people from Texas, people from South Carolina, Connecticut, New Jersey, New York, Boston. Anybody pick up that Boston I sent it in? There we go. Mike was doing very good there. Mark is blessed to have so many friends. It's actually always been a family joke that Mark just accumulates friends and never loses any. And he's fortunate to have so many of those friends here uh, tonight, as well as so much family. Honestly, the whole wedding kind of feels a little bit like a formality, because at this point I feel like Jess and the Krolls have been a part of our family for forever now. Jessica and Mark, as you move forward with your new lives as husband and wife, my prayer for you is that each day feels just like it does at this very moment. Your wedding day should act as a reminder what marriage really is, and that marriage is an opportunity to find ourselves through each other.
to the bride and groom. I love you both with all my heart. I look forward to sharing our lives together. Ready to come. Let's all raise a glass to a lifetime of happiness for Jess and Mark. I love you guys.